Hi, I'm Bowling Otter. And I'm Lizzie Sandwich. And welcome to The BS on the Internet. Well, it's been another one of those weeks. I wanted this week to go by really quick. Yes. And I'll tell you why. Why? Disney Plus right, is Disney next Plus is coming. Week! Yes, that's right. Oh yeah. my gosh, I'm going to be insufferable. Completely They're going to have a ton of good stuff on that. I mean, oh it's, it's kind of crazy. Guys, I don't know if you saw like the list of like launch titles or whatever. I just like I feel like I'm going to cry. <laughs> I feel like we're going to get it and I'm going to scroll through it and I'm going to cry. Okay. I really want to see The Mandalorian. Be prepared. Yeah. And that's going to be on day one, I think. So. I know. Psyched Are any that. of you guys getting it? Like, I know, like, the whole, like, corporate argument. And the M. Night Shyamalan that, but... thing, too. He did something else in Philly. What? Yeah. And that's a series, I think, maybe. No way. So the movie or series is something that he that he did for Disney+. Plus. He was in, like, town? Like, he was in the city? Yeah, apparently he did it in the city. He's here so him. much. If you don't know, we're from Philly. But oh, um, just he's, outside, yeah. he's here so much. Yeah. Like, he makes all of his movies here and stuff. So it's like, oh, I'm not John Wan's here again. And he's closed down the street or whatever. Yeah. But he t- he's gone outside the city recently. Mm-hmm. Kind of like in in the burbs. And, yeah. You know. Well, he did Signs in Bucks County. Yeah, yeah. Was, uh, we digress. Farms. Anyway. But yeah, it was really. I like Signs. Signs was good. Good. But also, Death Stranding came out this Death week. Death Stranding came out. Who's playing Death Stranding? We, ha- we have it, but we haven't tried it yet. We, we, we haven't started yet. So. I know. We were really going back and forth on whether or not to play it for the channel. It's way too. It's going to be way too long. I know it's yeah. going to be way too long. Oh uh, my I don't God. think it's realistic for us to try to do it. We're not so full time. We're not full time, so we're just not going to do it. I know. <laughs> but we I'm still want to play it anyway, so I think we're just going to check it out. Yeah, so, we'll know. try and you know work our way through it before yeah. bed and, and things like that. Yeah. But I'm excited. Like, yeah, I'm, I'm excited. I'm a little bit nervous that there's a baby in it. I, I think there's going to be plenty of weird things. We'll be distracted. I know. But so, oh my gosh, my notifications are on and I have a turkey notification on. And let me just tell you that having a uh, turkey notification on your phone for your text gets old really <laughs> quick. Really quick. So I need to change that when we're done. So Please if you were considering getting a turkey notification, I thought it was festive. Let's see what advice against it. I thought it was festive. Right. Well, let's get started. All right, first. So there is a Fortnite Pro uh, for the phase team, Jarvis. Yes. Phase Clan, rather. And uh, he is permanently freaking banned uh, f- by by Fortnite for using an aimbot. Now, how Epic old is currently. he? I think he's like 17. I was going to say, yeah. But I think he he's got a young. really popular YouTube channel. Like, I don't yeah. think he's a pro. Mm-hmm. At, like, as in, I don't think he does a lot of, like, the... the um, the competitions he's just a, one of the content creators for phase yeah yeah but he's a professional in that regard right um but yeah I, he was using an aim by apparently it wasn't in a competitive mode it wasn't in like the uh the ranked mode it was only in casual solos or in playground mode mm. that's what he says right right, um, right but um and apparently he was doing it for youtube content like he would make a video and be like this is me using an aimbot. Let's see right. what this is going to be like. Yeah. So it wasn't like he was trying to fool anybody. Sure. He was just like, hey, everybody, this is what it, using an aimbot looks like. And he didn't post a link to, to encourage anybody to use it. Or didn't show them how to install it. <sighs> but, I mean, they're still banned from the game. You cannot use For aimbots. For life? There's, there's cheat, you know, there's obviously cheat detection. He got caught. But yeah, he's banned for life. And this is like life. the primary source of his Ugh. content for his very popular YouTube channel. Yeah, yeah. So that's all his income and all his content. A lifetime ban. I mean, yeah, I give penalize him. Yeah, definitely yeah. penalize him. You pay, ban him for a year if you want to. Do it, right. like a, make it really stiff penalty. Yeah. But lifetime sounds. I, I'm sounds crazy. Yeah. Well, I'm curious to see the context and what the video was actually like. It's gone now. I it's thought down. so. I'm pretty sure okay. it's gone. Because I'm wondering if it was like. I think some people posted like... it on other sites though. Like okay. you can oh, see yeah, it somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. Because because I'm wondering if his tone was like, look, like this is what to look for. This is as like a as an educational type. That's thing. I think what he was claiming. Right. Because he put this big apology video up, that's up and everybody's got case. his like there's thumbnails of his crying face everywhere. It's right. a real right. shame. I know. It's a I real know. shame. Ugh. But uh, I didn't even know what he looked like for a long time. I only knew what he looked like ugly crying. No. And that's that's a real shame. Oh. But yeah, I mean he's 17 years old. That's. I mean, uh, it sucks. Because if does. you're a content creator and it's all based around one game and you can no longer play that game, that's yeah, scary. I, I don't know. care if you're 17 or not, you know? I, I do get the zero tolerance for using an aimbot yeah, and all that definitely. stuff. That is like, yeah, I'm okay with that. But Especially because just, of how feel, big of an esports game Fortnite is now. I know. You know? So it's, but I feel bad for him. I do. I yeah. feel bad. Poor dude. Yeah, Ugh, it's yes. bad, but... What do you think? Though? Do you think it should be a lifetime ban, or do you think it should shorten that? Because I think I, Phase I, Clan's gone from the shortened, of course. Yeah, yeah. But um, I don't know. I don't know if it changes or not. What do I you think? Know. 
Okay, next up, the new Sonic's face is out. Did you see this? No, I didn't see what this. What he looks like now. Remember earlier, if you guys don't know what we're talking about, I don't know how you don't know what we're talking about. They had this Sonic movie coming out, and he looks kind of like weird. A they little like look humanoid. Human. Yeah. And it was just strange, and there was this big backlash. So now pictures are leaking. This is a leak, so I don't okay. know if it's whatever, but I saw it all over Twitter. Because the, the fan like, art, <gasps> like, mock ups were brilliant anyway. Oh my God, they were amazing. You know? so, yeah. All right. All right. So, do you want to see it? You yeah. want to see? Well, of course you do. All right. So, here's the Sonic. I was say, is that, him? No, is that what it's like in the movie? Now? <laughs> here's what he looks like now. Oh. Oh, the eyes look more like Sonic eyes. He doesn't have the little beady human eyes anymore. Yes. Oh, I can't do this anymore. That's can a I? pretty big deal. That's right. All right. I know. That's a definite improvement. Look, he looks great. I think he looks good. Yeah, I think he looks way better. I know. I feel like comparing to up here. He's got okay, tiny so little skinny. He's eyes got are like green. skinny limbs again. He's uh, he has his legs. gloves back. Are they bigger feet? Are they big bigger shoes? Uh, I think so. I think it might be bigger shoes. Yeah, I'm trying to remember the other one, the original movie design. Yeah, I wish they like had like another picture next to it. Yeah, to so that we could uh, compare the two. Oh, his teeth. Oh, his teeth. That's yeah, right. Oh, we yeah. don't know about his teeth yet. If that's no. the only... Uh, oh, no. Why is this taking so long? Our internet has been... Yeah, we've been having what issues with our internet. I know. Oh, I did a stream that actually oh, died. Oh, that's my God. That's right. Yeah, look how Yeah, that didn't look that like is. him at all. He looks like, like a child. It looked how like somebody in a bad sign. Does he even costume. have a butthole? <laughs> <laughs> These are the things that people want to know. <laughs> but now, um, <laughs> that's funny. Okay. Okay. So that's yeah. An yeah, it's definitely an improvement. It's creepy. Definitely an improvement. Yeah, All I'm, right. I'm All in. Right. I think it's cool. All right, we'll see. All right. Okay, next up, I found this that was really interesting and kind of like, ugh, where James Dean, who died in 1955 and is now this, you know, pop culture icon, has now been cast in a movie about the Vietnam War. So, they're going to do the whole CGI, bring him back from the dead type thing, and they're casting him in a part. They said they were looking for somebody perfect to play this particular part in this movie. And, and they, they couldn't thought, find anybody. And they found nobody. <laughs> and they really wanted somebody like James Dean, so they thought, why not put James Dean in it? What do you think about creating... A, a, a bringing somebody back from the dead for a performance like this. Yeah, I think this is stupid. You know? I think this is terrible. It is. And, and you know what's messed up about it? And I was thinking, because it has to be somebody, like I'm really not 100% sure even how this works. Yeah. So it's somebody else's performance. Yeah. And then this person, and then James Dean's face voice. Yeah. Uh, put into and it's meshed a deep together. Fake technology. Yeah, that's what yeah. I thought. It was like yeah. a deep fake, right? Yeah. So I think. Uh, it, it, I feel like it does a disservice to the real person. A hundred percent. And their performance. Yeah, hundred percent. Like does. that's not their performance. Yeah. Like I, I saw somebody. To, I forget who it is. Oh, I'm gonna forget. But somebody said like, let's just gener CGI Picasso and have him paint another picture. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, is it that is. painting it's a Picasso? Yeah, let's just like you know, like some I some who musician, said that. I'm sorry, like John Lennon, like it. like like. Yeah, Put yeah. Put an algorithm together and be like, if John Lennon made a new song, this is what it sounded like. I'll yeah. bet it's coming. I'll bet it's coming. Oh, absolutely. You yeah. know, but, but I think that stuff's like kind of. It's like it does a disservice to, to Picasso and to John Lennon and to yeah. James Dean, who were so lovely and brilliant. Yeah. And then they're just like, hey, you know, let's just put you out. Do you know earlier, like I was looking at um, Spotify and something came up where it said tours near you or something like that. And one of them was coming soon Whitney Houston hologram tour. Yeah, I, I just don't, I'm Do you not know what I mean, I'm not guys? With this. I we have people doing it right now. I know. That need to be heard and seen. They're right here, right now. Yeah, how true is that? You know, that? <laughs> let's let's do that. I know, I know. I let I time go on. Yeah. Let us be inspired yeah, let's not get from stuck these in people the past, and create you know? our own art. And I just yeah, we have the catalog of all their work already. Let it exist. Like let's let's move on. Influenced by it. This I is I think this is terrible. But but then how but is this really what? gonna be received though? I don't know, but you know what? I am such a hypocrite because we were watching the Star Wars trailer the other day <laughs> uh -oh. and Carrie Fisher was in it. And I yeah, was like, but... I need to see Carrie Fisher. And I know that, I'm but like... I hate that too. <laughs> I and like, know. 
and I know that I'm not. They're in a I very know. different kind of spot. They're in an impossible position. Yeah, they are. They saw a supremely are, important character. They yeah, they're not resurrecting her to you know. Yeah. you know, decades later. Yeah, and they already had it written, and, and they were already in the middle of filming it. Like, I mean, that was absolutely terrible. Yeah. And so I kind of give them a pass on how they had to handle that. That's a good point. Yeah, but this is going out of the way. But like, we're just going to being, intentionally do this. Right, right. But like me being excited to yeah. see a CGI Carrie Fisher. I'm not really excited. I, it weirds me. I'll out. be like, oh, I'm sure when I see it, I'll be like, oh, that's weird. Yeah, but go, it's got that like uncanny I know they gotta valley do it, but thing. It still weirds me out. Yeah. I know, I know. But the whole deep fake thing and, and all that, like, I don't know. It just yeah, it's weird. It's super weird. I know. And you know what though? I like what would this do? I mean, to go off not too far but what would this do to people who were like grieving what if this is like a, mm. if they need to hear something from somebody who it has could be passed incredibly therapeutic. and they could see a deep fake or it could be really distressing damaging. or yes, damaging it, it could be either or I think that's a very individual you situation kind of thing you can move on like that's like a her have you seen her yeah. where you get kind of like it, how or, far uh, can uh, it go Black Mirror episode it's a whole thing. yeah yeah exactly yeah exactly and it's like how, how far but I feel like in this particular realm where people have died and then there's a way to speak to them or see them I feel like it can be incredibly incredibly damaging yeah to some people yeah. some people could be therapeutic but I don't know I'd be mm, I don't know that sounds scary it's I, weird. I, I it's do not weird. feel like this is a direction we should be going I know and I know we will just because we want to see how far the technology can go and we're obsessed with that I know and I'm curious about how far the technology could go but holy yeah. crap is going to be used in bad ways and like because not just I like politically like, bad, bad ways or like like illegally bad oh, ways yeah, I yeah. just mean like culturally bad ways oh yeah yeah you know like this I think this is bad yeah. I don't know. Yeah, Because I feel like everybody, you know, has a line or most people may have a line that's like, yeah, this is messed up. But if a John Lennon hologram was going out and it looked really good, would I pay to see a John Lennon hologram? I'm a humongous Beatles fan. Maybe. I can't think. Maybe. No, I can't think of a single, no matter how into really? them I was. I can't think of one artist that I would go pay to see a hologram of them yeah. do a thing that like I know because I know watching them like somebody else choreographed this somebody yeah, else yeah, danced yeah. this somebody else sung this they really yeah. used it to match it up to be like let's all pretend that this person is yeah. actually here doing something but they're not and it's not their creation Yeah. and if it's not their creation I'm really not interested right I don't know I I, I can't think of anybody that I, I would know. want to see I just oh god oh. I, I think yeah I mean I'm going around in circles but I, I feel like <laughs> If there are a number of people where I'd be like, would I, yeah, you know, like but Freddie Mercury or something. Yes, Freddie! <laughs> oh, Freddie! Yes, Freddie. Freddie. That, that may be it. It's weird because that like, be it, then you're not like watching a replay of a performance, but you're also not watching a performance. No. I don't know. It's very strange. I know. It's false. It's yeah. like a scarecrow. You know what I mean? I don't know. It is. But maybe it's how we're going to remember some people in the future. I don't know. I know. And yeah, so it's weird. It, yeah, it it's would hard, mess it's with hard your to relate to it coping now. process. I yeah. know. I know. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. Anyway, moving on. All right, now it's time for what you listening to. What you listening to. <laughs> so normally this is where we would do what you watching, but we haven't really watched anything new since. Uh, we, we're still on Parks and Rec. We're still watching we're Parks and Rec. We're in season five. We're, we're running through the whole Shane. thing. So we haven't really watched anything else. I had no time for anything else. So, but we have been listening to a new album that we were waiting to come out. Yes. So we, we do listen to a lot of new music when we get the time to do it. Mm. Uh, with certain artists that we really get excited about. And we are fans of the band Highly Suspect. Yes. Oh, 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 real quick, before you go into that. Okay. Would you guys be interested in seeing us talk about music or albums? or whatever? We're very much like music album people. Of course, you know we're We're very much music album stuff. people. You know what I mean? No, but albums as a, as a we unit. We appreciate as music. A, yeah, you know, we're we're both into music and have been doing yes. doing music our entire lives and yes. all that stuff. So we tend to, if somebody has an album, we like want to sit and we want to listen to it. Also, we want to listen to FKA Twigs. Yes, I heard she had a new album that came out that's amazing. Yes. Harry Styles on December thirteenth. Yeah, we got I like a lot that. of I albums like coming out. I like his single a lot. So, but like he was that. saying, highly yeah. suspect. Highly suspect. So Discuss. this is a band that we uh, we we discovered when what was the song. Uh, what was the song that well, was we were listening nominated for a My Grammy. Name is Human. My Name is Human. Right. Yeah, we were checking out the people who were nominated. And I'm always like, oh, who's Grammy nominated nominees. for rock now? Because rock is a very small place in like, the zeitgeist at the moment. Yeah. Um, and then they were nominated. And we right. went and listened to all the songs. And I was like, hey, I kind of really like that song. Got the album, listen to the album, like the album. Mm. Um, and just kind of came to be like, hey, these guys are doing some interesting stuff. Yeah, I wonder what album. they're going to do next. And they put out this new album. It's like, cool. Let's see what they decided to do. So we listened to it. Yeah. I 
don't hate it. I think I like it a little bit more than you do. It's kind of it's, it's kind MCID of MCID is the name of the album. Yeah. MCID. My crew is dope. My it has. A, we're gonna sound super snooty. It's not. We I are gonna sound super No, I understand where they're coming from. I really do. I totally do. But I, I think the concept of how I understand this album is, it, is kind of disjointed. Look, I can't even get it out, because I think their argument was that a lot of us have playlists. I have playlists. You have playlists where the songs are kind of like but 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 disjointed. You could have like a high, uh, like a high tempo song, a low tempo song, whatever. And then because mine, are, my playlists are like everywhere they're all across like decades and genres and all kinds of things so they wanted to make an album that reflected a playlist that you could have so they have songs that are kind of like hip-hop songs that are a little grungy songs that are a little like poppy some acoustic type stuff there's a song on here called Arizona that is beautiful that I love to pieces but then there's some other stuff with these weird like rapping sequences and he's trying to rap and it, it, it's it, it feels like each song is trying to be more different than the one before it and it just feels really like convoluted to me. Yeah, I, I totally understand the concept they have. I just think, I just really don't think that's a good idea for an album. For an album, yeah. Like a formula for an album. I love a narrative in an thematic. album, yeah. A, you know, and like, mm -hmm. I thematic, know there's like, yeah. I guess that's his theme that he mm -hmm. went with for this one, but like, boy, it I, in execute. I, mean, I was afraid of it when I heard that they were doing that. Yeah. In execution, it was kind of exactly what I was afraid of. Really? We haven't read any reviews or by anything. By the end, yet, yeah, we so haven't actually read. I, 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 I want to. They're starting to come us. out now. Mm -hmm. But um, <clears throat> by the end of the first song, when he's doing the shout outs. Oh, he shouts out his dog and his cat. Shout out to my dog. It's not, I mean, it's just like random stuff and like. And it's just like, like, what are you? What the hell's happening? And then there's the songs where he's just legit, actually. Rapping over trap beats. Yeah. And it's like. But you know what? It's uh, people like genres are bending right now. Musical I genres get it, are moving. But like people are kind of, you know, it's so accessible now. Yeah. So, so many, everybody can talk to each other. So a lot of people are collaborating and, and uh, different kinds of music are coming together that you don't think would. I feel yeah, like we're getting into a I shift. like music that's like that though. Yeah. That's, they don't do that. And like. <laughs> It's now that okay. they're, and they're trying to do that, and it's like, and all I can see, I, like, I, I hate to say this, it, what sounded tea. like a lot was, like, I can't mention this, there's a few songs that sounded like this to me, and I feel kind of bad about this, but mm. it feels like, like, somebody staying up all night, you know, like, caffeinated, like, in front of their keyboard, right, and, like, hitting the record button, and, like, playing some stuff, and then oh, playing boy. it back a loop, and hitting the record button, and then somebody walking in and be like, yo, 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 let me show you this thing I've been working all night, and then they, like, put it on the record. That's kind of what it sounds like. Well, Not all of it. Yeah. There are a few tracks in here that are really cool, that yeah. I really enjoy. Canals is really good. Canals is That's really cool. One. And yeah. like the stuff that actually, well, the stuff that sounds like highly suspect to me, right? Yeah, yeah. But like, it's this other stuff that like, hey man, I mean, I don't like, do whatever the hell you want to do. Yeah. People evolve. Yeah. They, they, I, I have no yeah. problem with people trying different genres, trying different styles. I don't think you could do the same album over and over and over again. No, no, no. But this, Nor this was, you. it's all over the place. Yeah. Well, like, maybe and I know that was the intent. The place. I know that was the intent. The place. That's fine. But I just, it didn't, yeah. it didn't end up being something but that I really enjoyed I'm, listening to. I'm somebody who's, there's a few songs here though. I would pick out totally. Every, yeah. 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 Absolutely. I feel like they <laughs> could have. Teddy Bear? Yeah, that's, oh gosh, yeah. I'm I've been sorry. texting him. He, one a, of the lines in one of the songs is, I want to be your teddy bear. But it's not just, I want to so be I've your teddy bear. It's the chorus. Him. Oh. And it's, I want to be your teddy bear. <laughs> like, it's totally heartfelt. It's, oh, and he says it over and over and over to the end of the song. I'm sorry. I couldn't take it seriously. He's angry. He's angry. But there's some cool stuff on here, and that's what makes me mad I about do. the other stuff. I do. I you know? understand. It, it's an it's an insight into. And another fan base is with. digging it, and that's totally they are. cool. That's good. Yeah, if you, you like know? it, whatever. That's you. If you got that's it out, I, I feel like there's a there's some people who make music, who they need to. Um, get it out yes get it off of their chest yes. like yes. like they have to like unload it or whatever it's you know some people write some people paint like it's it's like an outlet this is why i'm a music therapist oh my god <laughs> there you go. learning about lissy that's right but some people need it need it out it's like um yes but there's a difference here you know and i feel like he needed like it out a lot yeah, of songs do that though like that, and yeah. you just spit out songs yeah. you don't just like take all of them though but, like well, usually what you do they're babies. is write they're a bunch babies. of yeah, but that's never the way this works. Good albums don't work like that. Good uh, albums are never like I'm gonna write ten songs, I'm gonna put all ten songs in the album. Yeah. No, you write like fifty songs or forty, thirty, whatever, and you take like uh, the best right. of the best and you put them out. That's why sometimes you get B ties. Well, so maybe they didn't make the cut. Maybe you know? they wanted to do this because 
Rock and I don't know isn't. if they did that. I mean, maybe he did go through a million songs. Maybe, you know, maybe. This. But like rock right now is like, who, who do we have? We have Tame Impala. We have Highly Suspect. We have the 1975. We have, I think, Vampire Weekend put another thing out. I know there's more I'm forgetting. There are definitely there's a lot of like old school but bands that are still like around. Maroon like Queens of Stone Age and Foo Fighters and stuff like that. And, and, yeah. Yeah, Maroon yeah. 5 is barely rock. Yeah, you I know. know. I'm, like they're a pop band. Right. Um, but it's really just pop. And and like and Adam Adam Levine brings the band with him, right, right, essentially, right. you know. Maybe, but, yeah. Um, I don't know. I know. We I digress. Know. We yeah. talk about this a lot. Can you tell? Yeah, sorry. We yeah. Moving we'll on. Okay, it's time for the subreddit of the week, and uh, this week is startled cats. Startled cats. Oh my gosh! And I picked this one for this week because Juan and Felipe, our new kitties, yes, are now They're getting fully into trouble. comfortable around the house. Yeah. Felipe, we discovered this morning, is a digger. <laughs> He's in our plants. We have a plant named Bear Grylls that has survived, which, which is why he's named Bear Grylls. He survived, oh my God, like six years, seven, eight years. I think almost our entire relationship yeah, has been around. Yeah, yeah. And they were digging a Bear Grylls today. So now we're fiercely protective of Bear Grylls. We're yeah. like, don't you kill Bear Grylls. It's going to be hard to kill Bear Grylls. That's why we named them Bear Grylls. Yes, exactly. So now what we're going to do is we're going to get some foil. I am really off the deep end today, <laughs> aren't I? I, know, I have so much to talk to you guys about. So I went I know. to the got some foil. But we're going to get some foil and we're going to put it on the tables and around the plant because the crinkling. But startled cats, I digress, is they've been doing this to each other for the last couple days. Have you noticed that? Yeah. They'll get each other around a corner yeah, and, they, and they like we're not used to having other, two. They scare each other to death. It's, it's hilarious. Cute. But look at this. Okay, I think I lost some. Oh, snappers. <laughs> Check this out. Look. <laughs> oh, you're gone. Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> what the isn't, that, isn't that amazing? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that! Woo! Oh my oh, God! What? I know. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, it's insane. Snap is startled by the camera. Let's see. Oh! 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 oh. <laughs> Did you not know that was there? Oh my gosh! It was like a little bear cub. What did? It where did oh. that camera get there? <laughs> oh, he freaked out too. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Well, you know, there's like there's like a huge like animal right behind <laughs> the camera. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Little tiger with a big pants. Uh oh. Oh, he coming. Oh lord, he coming. Yay! Oh. <laughs> oh, she she totally. Yeah, faked. she faked it. Like, that's oh, I'm just really over here. Like, oh, ah! where did you come oh. from? Oh. That's a very that, nice parent. That's a very. It's a very parent. nice parent. I know, but if oh, you, you got me. You got me. <laughs> oh. Well, if you want a little, you know, little giggle, yes. go look over at Startled Cats because right. it's fun. What's a Snow Leopard Six Bum Mom? Hold on a second. Another one. Oh. I got, I got you. you. Yay. <laughs> oh my God. I love it. Oh, I can watch this all day. <gasps> we have a Pixar trailer. Oh, this is Pixar. Yes. Okay. And I'm seeing a lot of mixed stuff on Twitter about this. I'm really curious, but it, it's Pixar, so we're all going to cry. Okay. I don't know what this is about. Do you know what this is about? I don't. Okay. Nothing about it. Get ready to cry because we're okay. all going to cry together. What would you Disney Plus want to this be week? known for on Earth? short time on this planet you want to become the person that you were born to be don't waste your time on all the junk of life what am i doing oh. spend your precious hours doing what will bring out the real you the brilliant passionate you that's ready to contribute something meaningful into this world Got the gig. I really need a haircut today, man. Can you fit me in? Whoa, whoa, sorry. Huh. Oh my God. We know who you are, what Pixar. <gasps> We're gonna cry. Hello. Oh God. Oh, so what do you want to be remembered for? Probably for doing this funny cowboy dance. <laughs> Me too. Oh. Great. That's pretty good. Wow. Okay. okay. Oh, I love those. Interesting. Oh my God, can we talk about the helicopters here? Oh yeah, talk? helicopter seats. I love those. <laughs> I haven't seen them this year. No, no. 
this looks really good. Yes, it does. Of course, because it's Pixar, it's going to be yeah, lovely. Yeah, you look at like, like by the people who did this, 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 this. You're like, okay, okay, fine, fine. I'll just watch it. Cause... Do you? <laughs> yeah, you just watch it. But yeah. you still haven't seen Up. I have not seen Up, and I know Do I get crucified for that every oh, time God. we say that in the video. The comments are always well, like, you've never seen Up? You know what the problem is with Up, though? Is that you, I mean, the reputation that it has now, going into it, you know that you're going to get destroyed. It's yes. like Coco now. Yes. You know, it's like, oh, you're going to watch me. Coco? <laughs> like, if you're recommending Coco to somebody, you have yeah. to be like, take a minute, make <laughs> sure you're by yourself or you're home and you're not like, don't watch it. On, didn't you watch it on the plane? I watched it on the plane. I was on my way either to or from uh, Colorado. And uh, then it was, I watched uh, it bald and I was like, you got to watch it. That's basically what happened. I'm on a plane like. <laughs> <laughs> so sad. I, I, I think I had somebody it's next beautiful. to me too. And I'm just like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. It's so beautiful. So they're gonna they're gonna destroy us, of course. But those helicopters, can I digress? But those helicopters really funny about those helicopters. You know if you split them, it's sticky in the middle and you could stick it on the bridge of your nose like this. Wow. I used to ride my bike when I was little with like three of them, just be like boop, boop, boop. Just be like, everybody look. But you can't smile or anything and they pop off and you lose the complete. <laughs> look effect. at my nose. Yeah, look what I did on my <laughs> nose. <laughs> Look, look, is it funny? <laughs> <laughs> you're right. You just can't move your face. <laughs> oh, my God. You're totally right. <laughs> oh, anyway. anyway. Oh, my gosh. Oh, you're totally right. Oh, I felt that. I felt oh, that. Oh, good, good. Because it was like, look, 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 guys. Look, <laughs> look, 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 look. Yeah. Ah, oh. oh, damn it. So that was this episode of BS on the Internet. Twas! If you want to know anything more about what we talked about, links are in the description. Yes. Don't forget to watch us on Twitch. Let's try not to suck, everybody. Try not to suck. And by everybody, I mean me. And if you like this video, please support us on Patreon. Click like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, bye. Bye.